the signal mountain here in the Rocky Mountain National Park or close to Rocky Mountain National Park and uh, I'm still within the tree line as you can see and the biggest obstacle is uh, the uh, all the trees the down trees from the winter storms uh, it's very tiring time-consuming uh, that's how it looks like it's actually a well-established trail but uh, you can't go further than 10-20 uh, yards without climbing trees or backtrack and go around down trees. Besides that, it's uh, mostly sunny, a few clouds, the usual wind at this elevation. So I'm uh, at 11,500 roughly and uh, soon leave the, uh, the forest and uh, hopefully move a little faster above the tree line. After almost two hours of uh, bushwhacking over dead and down trees, I'm, uh, I reached the uh, tree line, and that's the first time I can actually see the summit that's uh, between the trees, that Signal Mountain. And this peak is South Signal. South Signal is not a soda peak, it doesn't have enough prominence. Too bad. Signal Mountain and the South Signal. 
As I mentioned before, it was tough going. Winter storms really did some damage to the forest here. Three hours, forty minutes, and six miles, and roughly four thousand one hundred feet of elevation gain. Oh, oh, oh. 